hey hi guys welcome to another video and in this particular video we are going to talk about one of the bug that has been found by Saugat Pokhril in Instagram that led him to view anyone's private email address and birthday and for this particular bug I mean for reporting this bug he got a bug bounty worth more than 13,000 USD or close to 10 lakh in Indian currency so let's understand this bug by going through this write up and try to draw what are the key learning lesson or what all things that we can learn out of it and also apply whenever we are doing any bug bounty right so let's jump into it so to begin with the introduction is like Saukat is from Kathmandu Nepal and he basically found this bug in Facebook right so on October 22nd he was basically looking at uh, Facebook security and privacy issues and he uh, again found that Facebook has launched one of the app called as Facebook Business Suite. So the learning lesson number one here is whenever something like new plugin that has been launched or maybe new functionality that has been launched or new application, being a bug hunter, you should always try that uh, particular new uh, add-on, whatever that has been uh, or plugin that has been developed. Now this will be mostly applicable whenever you are testing, uh, you know, high profile website like Apple, Facebook, Google and all those but also apply to any other website whichever you are testing so try it test for the new plugins or new added features mm -hmm. uh, that is where you will get more uh, bug whenever you are testing for a bug bounty mm -hmm. now to brief intro of who has provided what is this business suite so business suite basically upgrade version of page manager app so this will basically a business suite app or admin kind of app for uh, managing facebook pages so he has provided the link as well now if we open this business manager this is how it looks like i mean typically admin uh, page kind of app right so when you connect your own instagram account to this uh, facebook page through like page name settings and instagram uh, you can basically manage your page or whatever page that you have created in your instagram through this business suite right so when he was uh, trying to access this particular feature or maybe browsing through this particular app he found that uh, you know he whenever he pinged a particular user he could see his or her email address as well as uh, you know date of birth now this is where he basically looked through like what is the email privacy on instagram again the second learning lesson is like whenever you are testing new functionality try to browse through all those features that uh, is been added right so that you get better idea like whether that has been properly done or not now not always that you will see some email address something will be uh, a bug because you also need to understand whether that particular business logic features or whatever the features that, it, that has been implemented is basically a bug or not so he just confirmed that by going through this uh, instagram privacy policy and he just read couple of line okay whether you are actually allowed to view email address of a particular user or not right so you could see that some profile is not visible to anyone because it depends on the privacy setting of a particular user right so he could also then uh, went ahead and to his uh, profile and even tried changing this uh, date of birth to i mean never visible to other user but despite of that setting also he was able to view a uh, different user email address as well as the instagram now that is where he found this yes this is a definitely a bug or he got a confirmation that this is definitely a bug and he just went ahead and uh, you know tried to create a POC and uh, the next thing he tried basically creating a, another user account and uh, apply all those different combinations of settings now this is the third learning lesson so like whenever you are testing a particular feature you need to actually you know uh, check the features from different angles like uh, whether you could you know sign up using Facebook or Google whether that feature is enabled or not or whether the particular email setting is visible to public or not so this kind of all uh, combinations uh, you need to try uh, to validate okay in all direct all way that whether that particular bug is uh, really in a bug i mean a privacy bug or not for this kind of privacy related issues now once he got a confirmation from different angles or different uh, ways he could actually you know viewed a user's private private email address or data birth he just went ahead and uh, report this bug and since he was also part of this uh, workplace group where he can directly communicate with the facebook security users, a user so or security engineer so he just went ahead and notified one of the security engineer to look at the report 
right so again work group workplace group is one of the you know uh, group where different security engineers and other people are already available so you could directly reach out to them now once the issue got notified to the security engineer the issue was quickly triaged and even fixed mm-hmm. deployed in less than 2 hours now this is one of the important point uh with a big uh, organization like facebook google they do take care of this kind of issue pretty seriously and they just work very fast to apply the fix uh, so this is one of the lesson that i learned in uh one of the conferences while talking to somil sa uh, one of the again security researcher from india pretty senior security researcher so where he spoke about it's not about finding or you know or getting hacked it's about how quickly you can recover or how quickly you can applying the patch that is what represents a organization in a secure or more secure way so here you could see that facebook uh, applied the face within 2 hour which is pretty fast right and they just uh, fix this issue now after some time they notify uh, the patch to the security searcher or whoever guy has reported saying like we have applied the fix can you just go ahead and verify now this is one of the again uh, learning lesson like it's not about uh, you know reporting a bug you need to also verify the fix whether that is been fixed properly or not again while verifying the fix you can again try out some of the different bypasses like here what he has done basically you know he could saw somebody's a uh, bot date by uh, modifying some of the again uh, privacy settings again he was shocked and again he reported the issues right and this is like okay we already aware about this thing but we are working on fix uh, for that particular issue so he has basically created this nice video uh, that is basically a poc which we will try to see in fact i'll put the link uh, in the description also so that you can go ahead and uh, check that so here he has found the instagram page and uh, you know go to a particular message box and he said like hello message uh, to this admin user now in the admin user section again he just reply something then he try to went to this particular business.facebook.com and here he would try to you know view if the user okay this setting is not to say the settings if you could see that the user has settings like not to disclose the birth day or even your email address right so in personal information not to say right the date of birth now while testing one more thing you need to remember like always pay attention to this whenever you are testing for this privacy bug uh, pay attention to things like uh, phone number also also or address right so once again he has modified the settings and uh, whenever he went to this uh, view profile there you could see he could also find the user date of birth right so which was uh, again clearly visible so he reported these issues uh, through the facebook bug bounty and after waiting for 7 days he got an again reply like okay this is an critical issues or high priority issue for us and we have applied fix and we are going to pay you some big amount for that like 5 digits bounty for that so this is the timeline he has provided and uh, this is the message that he received from facebook support saying like your report demonstrate the ability to fetch an email address of a user and birthday if the provide that user personal information right and since he was part of this bronze league he could i know facebook provided some more amount for him like multiplying with 1.05 uh what bounty so finally he got an some bonus as well and he got a bug bounty worth 13125 usd right and uh, i hope like you know he says that you would have uh, enjoyed the reading so also i hope that you guys would have got some uh, you know learning out of this particular bug and i am sure that this things will definitely help you understanding uh, as well as while you are trying for finding this kind of bug so thanks for watching this video have a great day enjoy your time bye bye